Uh, welcome back everyone. I've decided to change things around a little bit. I didn't get all this area mapped out. I went ahead and put a uh, fab to base in right here just for the purpose of needing to get larger constructor setups going. Uh, really should be getting some more power than that, I think. But it is fairly overcast out still. Once those clear clouds clear out, I do believe we'll be getting a lot better power coming in. As I add it, this little base here um, only comes with these two solar panels up top. So I fabbed up these four large ones to get more power into the place for the constructors. This one is uh, da, 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 da. Uh, which base was it again? There it is. The Zero G drop base. It's only level three. Very easy to do. Primarily, I did it just for, like I said, to get the structures and stuff going. Made up a couple boxes. Uh, dropped a small constructor there to be able to build this one. This one's going to build the advanced constructor. Uh, and then I also brought this MX-1 in. The MX-1 is a small vessel level seven it doesn't take a whole lot of materials to build either not very heavily armored or anything like that but it's good it's going to be good enough for us to do what we're going to want to do here pretty quick uh just over level seven that's going to change very rapidly here shortly uh because i'm going to go do a the outside ring of a a POI. I'll do more of it than that if some things drop, like better armor, better weapons. Uh, if the better weapons drop, I'll have to come back and get whatever ammo I'm going to need to use that. Uh, before we take off, actually, instead of you, yeah, I'll just use this. This ship does have. some items on it. You have a drone hatch, which is right here. I'll go ahead and open that. Yep. And I believe you got to be standing right about here. Okay, maybe it's back here some more. There it is. Here's your drone view. You can mine with the drone. You can do a bunch of different things with the drone. Uh, close that back up. Uh, you have spotlight control switches. You have an ammo bay here. Uh, this is a storage bay. It comes with a little over 4,000 storage. Your O oxygen. A small ammo uh, armor locker and an O2 station so you can fill your O2 up on the ship also it also has a small refrigerator uh, so we're able to store up more food without it going bad on us I'm not planning on building up the base all that much because some things 
I read up on with this new patch, I think I might stay primarily space-based. Um, might build a space station above this one. I don't know where I'm going to do it yet. But I think I'm going to be primarily space-based. Uh, we got a lot of resources still. And we'll go find out what that question mark is. Uh, iron there. My plan is, depending on what this question mark is up ahead of us, we're not coming up to zero. I don't think we've got a zero X space. No, we don't. Okay, this is a place we might be able to get some decent stuff, but I want a long gun. I want a rifle before going in here. Uh, so we'll come back to the Elder's Tomb. That is for sure. Once I get a long gun. But what we're going to do is do the outer ring of this unknown artifact. And hopefully a very nice Uh, actually, this isn't the unknown artifact that it will give us that part, but it will give us some things. So, we'll go to the other one here in just a minute. I don't particularly like this one from the cockpit view. Back off a little bit. That right there is the core. Just blew up the core. Change the view. Release it. What I'm going to do is... Get this. So I can exit out my back hatch. Just like so. Get the shotgun. Oh, come on, don't do this to me now. Let's see if we straighten it up, if it'll work better. There we go. Now, by shooting the core out. If you don't do that first, you get a bunch of NPCs coming at you. Not what I particularly wanted from here, but it is a tier 2 multi-tool, so we'll swap that out. But I do get some better armor, which is part of what I want. So, we're going to swap out that armor, put this here. Uh, Jetpack boost temperature is what we'll run. Put this one in here. And we got a bunch of neodium. That is nice. So go here. Now crash capital vessel. is the one I'm looking for. That's the tower. So since we're already down here, we'll check out this one here to the east. I got turned around. I thought that was the one I was looking for. Unfortunately, it wasn't. Like I said, alt button, the left one right by your space bar, gives you free flight or camera motion. 
We want to stay fairly away from the Xerax. We're not really built yet to take those guys on. Uh, the drones aren't a concern, but you've got weapons on those uh, facilities. And I don't want to raid the our, uh, weaponed up facilities yet. And I went east instead of west. So we'll do a little exploration. See if we can find something else of interest. To go after. We've got a couple points over here. I'm not all that interested in. And we'll go check that one out after this. Some of the white question marks have some pretty good stuff in them. Some don't. shelter this is another place you could use like uh, instead of spawning in a small base use something like this with solar build your uh, constructors and just go with that I've done that on a lot of uh, game rolls I do like the new scan setup. I really believe I'm going to like it when we go into space because you don't have to do the old searching around for the asteroids quite as much. Which I will be um, getting a drill if I don't loot one from one of these places here pretty soon. Ancient outpost. And some ruins. We've got something in that direction. That might be a Xerox facility because we are really close to the crash capital vessels right on the edge of a Xerox territory. So that's probably going to be a Xerox base. Future videos, I'll when I'm better armed, I'll go after more of them. I'm wanting to build up, get some decent uh, ships and things before I start doing the solo mission. Same thing with this.
actually. I'll do it. I'll do this. See if they pull up. Nope. Used to be you'd just do that much and they would come out very strong. Okay, that should let me do it. A lot better loot. Not exactly the kind of stuff I was looking for, but we got another standard shotgun and a sniper rifle. But a lot of medical supplies. And the neodymium we will need in the not too distant future. Um, and larger fuel reserves. Okay, so those aren't the one. North and east. There was something over that way. I've seen two of them of the type I wanted to hit on this clip. But I haven't hit the right ones yet. They still gave us some decent stuff. My food's getting lower than I preferably like, but I don't want to eat that. Oh, they changed it down to 300. That used to be 500 health. Okay, this one is one of the ones. Is the style I was looking for. And we'll see if we can get what we're looking for out of here. Now the thing about these are you can just kill your thrusters and you're good to go. Right on the ramp. I usually like to do these when I got a lot better gear. fall down or did he clip into the ship I think he went and fell off the ledge it's the issue with these guys in this level of shotgun they don't go down very easily even if you hit them right in the head I'll take them falling off the side. You would think with a shotgun,
you'd actually be able to do more damage than that. There we go. I still want a tier two shotgun, but I'll take that one. Get rid of the spawn point. Um, actually, we'll go ahead and clear all of this stuff. Humorous. It's the way they set some of these up. This is the other faction, so we can't open that door. I am not sure what that does. It opens the door. That's why I need to get some more ammo. For the long gun. Go ahead and move this stuff. Over to there. How far are we from the main, from that base? Not too far. I'm gonna label that to come back to this. I wanna get some long gun ammo. We'll try one more. Actually, let's do another one if I used to do this. Since I have the ammo. For this. Let's see if they'll cooperate for us.
spider in that one. I hear a horror, but I'm not sure if he's here. I really would like to upgrade these weapons, that's for sure. Nice. We got some boom boom. As you can see, this is a very efficient way of clearing these sides to get to these canisters here. That's the better salt rifle. Same shotgun, rifle upgrade kit. Okay. One more of these. Get some long on ammo and I can clear the core of this place. Because we one thing about doing it this way, you lose out on a whole lot of experience points. But I was really hoping to get a good long gun, which we got a decent long gun out of it, but we still need a little bit more to get things really set up nicely. that spawn point is still active. I'm not sure how that stayed up that long.
Now what I'll do is, after I clear this loot box, oh, beautiful items to drop, just not particular things I really, really want right now. That's going to help us when we go to build our next ship. But it's not really helpful for where we're at right now. So I'm not going to worry about those overhead tanks. I'm going to go ahead and see if we can find these guys down below. Because by finding them down below where they fell, if they're still in this same general area, which they are, we can recoup the experience. thing I don't like about this ship is its yaw is its twist rate is really really slow now I would have ideally liked more of those guys to still be down below probably should have come down after each time But I did see us gain another level in experience. Um, oh, that looks good. So I'm going to go ahead and turn us back towards base. And what I'm going to be going for ship-wise next, I'm going to, there's one more of those types of bases I'm going to clear this same, same way, and I'll start another video when I actually go in to clear them. Uh, but I'm going to have to come out here and get a pretty heavy load of ammo. And a full clear of one of those bases is a good hour long. So I'm going to go back to the base we haven't touched yet. And I'll start the video up there. And it'll be just for that type of base clear. Uh, I think that would be the best way to do an efficient video on it. So I'll bring you all back in when I get all that stuff set up.